Hello and welcome to my video today. My video today is unboxing a set of Heed upper crash bars for a Triumph Tiger XC8. Heed do a really good product. Um, comes delivered straight from Poland to your door. Well packaged. This arrived on my doorstep this morning and I've unpacked it. The one I've ordered this time is the ones that come with the bags. The bags from Heed uh, seem like pretty good quality. These pop are onto the frame bag themselves. Um, they've got internal pockets within those, so you could stash something like a mobile phone in there, charge that up where it's easy access to some of the power outputs on your bike. Not only that, these are not too big, but actually, first impressions are you're going to get a few extra knickknacks and that when you're out touring. So that's a really good start to get us going. When the package arrives, there's lots of packaging, which is really good. If you spent out on your products, they arrive and they come in a big cardboard box. Then, just for reassurance, everything's kind of double, triple wrapped. The heat product comes with instructions. The instructions are both in Polish, so Dobrze, Jakszymaj, to my Polish friends. Um, the instructions themselves aren't too clear. Um, I'm going to be doing a video about how to fit these, so hopefully that will help you out if you're looking to get some upper crash bars for your Triumph Tiger or any other bike that he is supporting with their products. <coughs> with this comes a nut and bolt pack, as you'd expect. There's a few extra things that you do need to do in here. It has the front clamp. The front clamp, again, everything from Heed has come super well wrapped and it's going to take a while. You just saw me use a standing knife to cut some stuff off. If you're doing this, be careful. Don't cut yourself, obviously. However, don't scratch your product. Brand new product, you don't want to damage it, first of all. If you can, get yourself a set of tough cut scissors. Always useful in the workshop, so that you can tough cut a lot of this stuff off the edge from the packing tape. Nice thing is, on the front mount, this one comes with a bit of a cross purpose for me. I'd like to see improve from Heed. One of the ones is the fact that the side bolts here do come with nylon lock nuts and plastic cups. This part here that's going to bolt onto your speedo support for your bike only comes with plain nuts on there so they can spin obviously, fall off, lose that down the road. I'd like to see those updated with nylons. What I'm going to be doing when I'm going to do the video to fit this, I'll replace those 8mm for nylon lock nuts because it's going to be a lot better that way. Also comes with extra additional bolts that you need, comes with spacer bolts. These spacer bolts are for one part Allen head bolts and when you're going to go and fit these up you're going to need to get yourself some Loctite as recommended in the fitting instructions. But I'm not sure whether I'm going to use Loctite, actually I'm going to use some copper slip on these to make sure that if I ever want to take them off I can service things, take off bits and pieces, I can actually separate these nice and easily without the Loctite. So you got a whole pack of bits and extra washers and parts in there. So obviously take care with those when you unbox in. Don't lose any bits and pieces. The other nice thing about the Heed product, as I said, loads of extra bits. If you look at the packaging on this, really nice. Not only that is when you look at this more clear, clearly and more closely, the powder coating on these really matches well with the Triumph OE product for the lower crash bars. You can get a lower and upper from Heed. Here I've just gone for the upper crash bar set to see how they go. I'm just going to undo this. And again, do take care. Like I said, a set of tough cut scissors you can go un underneath there so that you don't end up scratching anything. And it will cut through the foam packaging and it will cut through any tape that you've got on there as well. You get a crash bar for the left and the right obviously for, with this product which means that make sure you lay it out on the floor and have a good look but what you're looking at as you can see is a pretty well bent i understand these are cnc bent so all the angles are going to be right for your bike and i'm looking forward to fitting these up to my triumph and really identifying with a good product the reason i've got these going touring going to be riding a little bit of places where you're unknown a little bit of off-road so you're going to want to put an extra bit of protection on your motorcycle. I think this product from Heed is really good. And as you can see, when you get the 
tank bags. The tank bags are also handed left and right for your motorcycle. So these are going to fit in the frame just here. Overall, really useful product, really useful to access your accessories while you're away on tour. Loads of opportunities to mount GoPro cameras or extra film cameras for yourself or strap other things onto. Most of all, they offer really good protection. Recommend a product like this, I'm impressed. Thank you very much for watching.